Ms. Stinson with Fulton County Library System and today we're going to make peel bottle noise makers. You only need a few items to make this. Um, you got some peel bottles, um, some beans, rice, your colored pencils, and a piece of paper and some glue. So, um, I will, you can go through, see if you have any of those items at home and like I said, it won't take too long. And um, you may not go be able to go into stadiums to see your favorite teams, like the Falcons, <laughs> or the Braves, or Atlanta United, anyone in the Hawks right now. But you can sit at home and root for your favorite team. And when they score, you can just shake the bottle when they air time they score. So let's get started. So we're gonna do first is, we're going to get some paper, it could be white paper or any color paper or any paper you want. We're going to cut it and make sure you, um, you can use some scissors as you want to do that or caregiver for scissors. So now I'm going to use color pencils. You can use markers if you like, but I'm going to use color pencil and you know you can just do, I'm going to do stars. Just gonna do stars. And I might add some cards here. Yeah, let's just change it up. Just different little designs. Any kind of design you want. And then now I'm gonna do some flowers. I'm not the best artist, but <laughs> I'll have some fun with it. I think I can do a tulip. Yeah, that's a tulip. <laughs> Alright. Uh-oh. Alright. So keep one in there. And like I said, it's your peel bottle, so whatever you want to make. And so, I think I'll do another heart. Okay. All right. I'm gonna change up the colors a little bit. Another heart there. Okay, so you got your design. So, you're gonna measure it out. That's, you got that measured out, so all you need to do now is just trim it down so it can fit. Okay. Right there. there. So now this is where your glue stick. And you can, if you want to, you can use Elmer's glue or you can use a hot glue gun, but for this craft, I think you could just use a glue stick. Make sure that gets on there nice. Make it stick. So what we're gonna do now is try to put this around here. Okay. Oh, see? Ta -da. <laughs> so we got the our design on here. Now we are going to get some that the southerners, a lot of southerners like, or anyone, some black eyed peas. So I'm gonna put some black eyed peas in here. And like you can use pinto beans, black beans, any kind of beans you want to, as long as it's a dry bean. You know, you ask your mom or dad or anyone else which ones, because certain ones they may not want you to use. And also to make some more noise, you might you can put a little rice in here. Not a lot, just a little. Okay, so then you do that, and so put the top on there. So every so when Julio Jones score, scores, you can say <laughs> when the uh, when the um, uh, Braves score a uh, home run. So and then um, you know you might not want to do it too much. They might make too much noise, or your mom or dad might not like it, but. You know, it's just a fun little thing to do, and mom and dad, you can make this for the younger kids and they can play with it. But uh, for younger children, um, just make sure that the top is on because you don't want them swallowing any beans or meat. But that's it. That's how you make a peel bottle mushroom. Thank you for watching Maker Wednesday. Tune in next week at the same time when we'll have another great craft. Don't forget to sign up for Beanstack. Our theme is Fall into Reading. You just have to read five books. Uh, they can be physical books or digital books. The challenge ends November 3rd, so you still have time to sign up. 
even books that are read to you during streaming story time, which is Monday through Friday at 11 a.m. Uh, Beans that information can be found at fullcolibrary.org. Once again, thanks for watching and share this video and all our great videos with your friends. See you next time. Bye.